All right, guys, I've got a piece of equipment here that's a very old piece of equipment. I wanted to show it to you. Um, it's called a sweep. This was used back in the day when they had horses and mules pulling plows to plow in between rows with. Now, to show you how far apart they put their rows, uh, the mule hooked up or the horse hooked up to that end right there, and it had a, it had a, a plow that pointed down the ground to help keep it centered. And you had a, a well, this was called a foot adjustment right here. You could adjust the foot underneath the bottom of it right here to set the depth of this. And then you had a lever right here that could be moved from side to side. Um, that spread these out or narrowed them up so that when the animal walked between the row, and it had two wooden handles coming up here, just like my hoss tool does, and you stood behind it right here as the mule pulled it along, and you could watch these right here. These things right here, these blades on the edge, they ran right under the surface, depending on how deep you set it, and clipped the weeds off right underneath the edges of the surface and plowed between the rows. But now I wanted to show you the thing that's different from gardening today is Back then, they didn't use a lot of commercial fertilizer. Whatever the soil had in it, other than maybe some manure, that's all the old people had. So their rows were like, this is in between the rows. Now the rows would be like right over here. They were almost like four feet apart. The rows were. Today, we do a little bit more conventional gardening and a little bit different. We put our rows a lot closer together because we have mechanized equipment to do it with. But I wanted to take and show you, I'm going to rebuild this, and I'm going to have it back like brand new again. Repaint it and everything, and put new handles on it, and new bolts everywhere. I'm going to make this baby like a brand new one again, because you know what? I don't know. I may have to have this thing one day. And it sure would be nice to go ahead and have it ready when that day comes. And if that day never comes, then hey, it's a great piece of equipment that can be passed on to someone who might use it one day. But, so guys, I wanted to just, it's just a short video to show you some of the different pieces of equipment that's out there that our forefathers used. Uh, this is a mule drawn sweep. And that's all it's used for, to my knowledge, is just to clean in the middles of the rows. You could do corn, cotton, whatever it was they planted, uh, vegetables, you know, and there's parts missing to this, I'm sure, that I'm gonna have to locate, but as a whole, it's in pretty decent shape, and I'll, you know, I'll go in and sand it, clean it all up, get the rust off of it, repaint it. Anything that's bent a little, I'll probably try to straighten that out. I don't even know who made it. I don't know if there's any markings on it. It's just something that I come across and thought like I might want. Um, but it's called a mule-drawn sweep, or a horse-drawn sweep, whichever way you want to look at it. And... I just thought it might be something that y'all would be interested in seeing because so many pieces of equipment like this now are obsolete. No one even knows about them. And when, when we come across them, I think it's good that we learn about them and that we know what they are and that they're out there. And I'm sure some of y'all may even have them. I just didn't have one. And when I saw it, I knew I wanted it. So thank you for joining me on this little bitty clip of tools from the past. Thank you guys from Deep South Homestead.